Welcome back to Lab Week, everyone. This is your Blue Devil News. I'm Finley. And I'm Reagan. Cafe Blue is excited to say that they will be serving breakfast on Thursday and Friday this week during first and second block. We have a limited but great menu. Have your teacher submit your order as quickly as possible to give us time to get it to you. They can find the link in Ms. Morgan's email. Graduation will be here before you know it. In fact, this year's graduation will be May 29th at Lipscomb University. Speaking of graduation, host members' graduation stoles are on sale now. If you are interested in being recognized at graduation for your health, science achievements, see Ms. Tomlinson to place your order. Students must either have completed three health science classes and be state and nationally HOSA affiliated or have completed a minimum of five health science classes by graduation. The cost is $25. Make checks payable to LHS HOSA. Orders will be taken through February 16th. Senior fee of $75 is due March 5th. This includes your cap, gown, diploma, and cover, and other costs with graduation. Go to LHS website to pay. Seniors, Tennessee Promise extended the FAFSA deadline to March 1st, and they are also offering webinars for the eight hours of required community service due to COVID. Also, there is another FAFSA event Monday, February 22nd from 12 to 4. Signups are required, and families can reserve a time at Genius.com. Tennessee Achieves recognized that completing in-person community service hours may be challenging. As an additional resource, we have recorded a virtual opportunity for you to complete community service hours. Go to tnachieves.org. The softball team is having a grab-and-go pancake breakfast on March 13th from 8 to 10 at Emmanuel Baptist Church. Tickets are $5, and you can buy your tickets now from any softball player or email coach Atwood. I'm sure you have heard by now that we will get to have prom this year. It's May 7th here on the soccer field, and it will be a night to remember. Tickets are $40 if purchased before March 26, and $50 after that. Tickets will, be, will not be sold after April 23rd. You may purchase them at the bank or online. Yearbooks are still on sale for $90. Pre-orders have ended, so we are currently selling remaining stock and do not anticipate having extras. We sold out last year and expect to do so this year. Orders can be placed using school cash or on yearbookforever.com. The deadline to order senior ads is quickly approaching and has also been extended until February 15th. To order, upload photos, and write messages, please go to yearbookforever.com. Environmental Club will ha be having a meeting after school in C206 tomorrow and Friday. Due to COVID restrictions, the hardworking yearbook staff is having a hard time collecting content. Please send any pictures of this school year to lhssouvenir at gmail.com or upload to yearbookforever.com or email BDN and we will make sure the staff gets it. Did you miss registration for next year? Even though the student portal on Skyward has closed, you can still add classes or make changes to your schedule. Just go by guidance and request to see your counselor. If you are wondering what to take, here are a few course promos to help. Hello, I'm Mr. Davis. I'm the auto teacher here at Lebanon High School. Uh, I teach auto mechanics, of course. My students actually get to work on vehicles. I teach four different classes. Uh, MLR1 is our basic class. You learn about uh, safety tools, uh, how to change a tire, how to remove a tire from a rim. My second class, MLR2, is electrical. We learn about starters, alternators, wiring diagrams, lighting on a vehicle. My third class, MLR3, is brakes, steering, and suspension. I teach you everything about that. And my fourth class is MLR4. It's air conditioning, engine performance, automatic and manual transmissions, drive axles, CV joints, U joints, everything like that. I think my class is beneficial to everyone because everyone is going to be driving. You need to know how your vehicle runs and whether or not you're going to be a mechanic or not, you will know what that mechanic is doing to your vehicle. Hey, I'm Mr. Shrum. Um, I'm the AP Human Geography teacher here at Lebanon High School. Um, the reason you should take this class is AP Human Geography is a class that 
really touches on every subject that you can think of. We cover a range of subjects from geography all the way into environmental sciences. We cover just about everything, even agriculture and urbanization. This class can be used in a variety of different ways. It is an AP class, so it is difficult, but that shouldn't deter you from trying to take this class. It's a lot of fun. We have a lot of fun. And yeah, come and join my class. Criminal justice um, is a part of Skills USA, which means we've got the classroom classes, but we also have contests that happen extracurricular outside of school. Um, Skills USA is a trade organization. So for criminal justice, we have students that can compete in crime scene investigation. You can go and actually investigate a mock crime scene just like you would in real life. Um, compete with students from around Middle Tennessee. Um, if you compete and win, you possibly stand the chance of going and competing at the state competition in Chattanooga. And from there, um, they have the option to go to nationals and compete in Louisville, Kentucky against students from all over the country. Uh, we also do law enforcement competitions, so traffic stops, uh, felony stops, interviews and interrogations, fingerprinting, everything that you would find in law enforcement. They do mock court competitions, uh, sort of like an appellate court, uh, where you can compete and, uh, against prosecution and defense teams. They do all sorts of different leadership contests. They compete in um, job interview. They compete in chapter display. You can uh, show your creative side and build um, displays to show off your club. Lots and lots of different options for competitions and um, lots of opportunities to travel around the state, travel around the country, and get to compete in criminal justice. Um, criminal justice is one of the elective focuses you can have at Lebanon High School. Um, you'll start with Criminal Justice 1, which includes things like the Cops, Courts, and Corrections is the um, umbrella of the class, so you'll learn about um, like what police officers would do, how the court system works, um, how the jail system works. We'll also talk about the Constitution and state laws the basis of like where the criminal justice standards are coming from and you also get to participate in a mock trial. Um, criminal Justice 2 um, focuses more on investigations so you'll get to learn more about um, how crime scenes are processed, um, what causes crimes and criminals, criminal behavior, um, analyzing criminals and things like that. Um, you also do a mock crime scene and then in Criminal Justice 3, you'll kind of go more in-depth into the crime scenes, learning more about blood spatter, bullet trajectory, um, other things, including um, like actual investigations of crime scene, trying to figure out who committed a crime, um, matching bones, and other things like that. This week is an exciting week for LHS sports. Not only is wrestling entering postseason play, our swim team advances to the next round of competition, but our girls and boys basketball teams have their last regular season home game. Wrestling is competing in the district tournament Friday, and those that advance will compete in the regional tournament Saturday. All meets will be held to at Beach High School. Times and costs of admission will be announced later. Our swim team has a meet this Saturday at the MTSC High School Invitational. Last meet, we had eight personal bests, seven regional qualifiers, and three state qualifiers. The state qualifiers are Emma Perugi, Wade Matthews, and Walker Orbke. Last night, our boys and girls rolled over the Green Hills Hawks. Not only did Coach Barrett get his 300th win, but Coach Mack's boys were in the best in district Hawks record. Friday, our basketball teams take on station camp here at LHS. The girls start at 6 and the boys right after. You can purchase tickets online at GoFam.com. If you can't make it, both games will be live streamed on our LHS BDN Facebook page. That's all the news we have today, LHS. I'm Reagan. And I'm Finley. And this has been news to you from the white and blue.